Welcome back to Mix Remix. Once again, it's time for the Crazy Karens. Check it out. I'm not gonna lie, you need a shower. Yeah, okay. I'm not gonna lie. It smells so clean, so fresh, so clean. I'm not gonna lie, you need a shower. Fresh kitchen, FK. Yo, f you and your mama. You, you wanna f Hell no! Nah. Oh god. Bro! Oh my god. <laughs> Listen to Karen's psycho. Bye. Who is you? Shut the f up, man. Later. Get your ass up. Oh my god. What? Oh sh Hey, she drunk as hell harassing us. No, I'm not. Okay, you want to take blame pictures? it on me. Blame it on me. Hey, you can't you know what the f is in the we don't know her. Look, we ain't association oh, don't with this your thing. Don't no. like that. Come back again. Oh! Oh my God. Do you? No, this chick's crazy, man. It's not a Karen. This chick is just nuts. Now there is a fine line. I've noticed this recently between Karens and you know drunk crazy people. Or Karens have their own category. They really do. People like this are just nuts or drunk or, but that's not what Karen is. Karen actually believes that she is the center of the universe and the most entitled person there is. That is Karen. This chick doesn't think she's entitled. She's just feeling good and trying to mess with these young boys. It's not a Karen, it's not a Karen. Karens are the ones with the butch haircuts running up to the customer service desk saying, look, I'm entitled, and whatever you just sold me is a piece of crap, so you're gonna give me my money back, or I'm gonna scream and holler until the cops come. Do you and then I'm gonna scream and holler even more until they arrest me. Hey, you're me. And then when they arrest me, I'm gonna scream and holler all the way to the jail. Oh, Hi, Karen. It's a baby. It is a baby. You don't crazy? bring your fucking baby in a fucking Stop fucking yelling at me, oh. damn it. Hey, bitch. Don't fucking yell at me. I'm only yelling at you because you're yelling at me and I'm trying to get you to no, you know, I'm trying to tell you if you plan on finishing your dinner, get the fuck down. She's had one too many margaritas, I think, tonight. That's what I'm telling you. Because other people are trying to have a conversation. That's what I did with my children. I didn't have it Did so loud. Did you say that? Where, where people at my table, at, pe at tables next to me, couldn't hear me talking. Yeah, I don't, I don't. Boys, so everybody in the damn restaurant. Ma'am, listen. Yeah. You, you start screaming at the top of your voice. I never heard the baby. I never heard the baby. We never even heard the baby over there. We're sitting right there. We're sitting right there. I went to the bathroom earlier. I can hear the baby in the bathroom. I'm sitting right there. What baby? And everybody I agrees. Can Look. Hear her and here comes the sheriff, lady. You're probably going to jail. Now we're gonna get everybody's food to go, and y'all are gonna I'm just trying to get up out of my seat. She wouldn't let me out of the seat, and she stopped that thing. We stay before going to jail. Okay. So get your food to go, pay your check, and go. Okay. He told you what's up. Going to jail now, bitch. <laughs> they never learn. They never know when enough is enough. Karens just keep going like they just expect everything to be fine. They expect people to bow to their will because they are the most entitled people on the planet. What they say goes and that's that. Do what I say and everything will be fine. Otherwise, we'll clear out of here. But most of these Karens don't ever seem to read the legalities of what they do. We'll never get them in trouble. So they are so surprised the second they get handcuffs put on them. And I think that is hilarious. Like they can talk to these sheriffs or cops like they're their children. One, two. And you are not gonna put your disgusting rules on me that are false and not true. Do you understand that? I will not have it. And it's not gonna happen anymore. Do you understand? Turn around. Oh my gosh. Oh You're my gosh. Play this game. Oh my gosh. Good luck, Karen. Good luck in that cell. Here comes Karen, the Road Rage Edition. It was to kill. 
mindless eating machine. Here comes Karen. Oh, God. Oh, my God. What just happened? You better get control of your f***ing man! Oh, my God. This Karen you has claws. You f***ing loser! <laughs> Go back to Mexico, you f***ing! <laughs> this is a Karen. This is what I'm talking about. This is a Karen. Because she's so entitled. Oh my god. She just deserves everything. This is this is a Karen. <laughs> this is a Karen. Racist. Racist, entitled, and absolutely insane. That's Karen. Hi Karen. Here's Heather. And I'm a Karen. Recovering. See, now in my last episode, I asked if anybody could be a recovering Karen. Right here's the proof. See, I'm a recovering Karen. Karen's anonymous. The two things I actually said. Oh, my God. That's awesome. This is Heather. And I'm a Karen. You're probably wondering what a Karen is. No. A Karen is someone. We know. And yells and screams for any reason. Right. It should not be. Okay. With the recent outbreaks of Karens all over the United States, I am the founder of Karen Anonymous. <laughs> yes! We are here to offer love yes! and support for anybody. This is suffering. so needed. Oh, that's awesome. I was just, just, just asking. Karens, when will they listen? When will they learn? They won't, otherwise they wouldn't be a Karen, I guess. I wonder if you can be a reformed Karen. Can you be a reformed Karen? Can you be a... Recovering Karen. I wonder if there's Karen's anonymous. There might be. Have to look right e -bike. This is a let me know down in the comments. Please let me know. Here comes Karen. You dumb <laughs> Pull your heads out of your <laughs> Each <laughs> die. Go suck a shit. Learn how to be a decent human being, you worthless piece of That sounds like a double standard, you buff. Wow. You can eat Come on. Come on, Come on. Come on. No, you're f***ing that with a Porsche, right? Hit me, That's all I can do, b***. Come on. You are trying to get your little f***ing kicked, aren't you? Try me. Try me. Try me. <laughs> Learn to f***ing die, you f***ing moron. I'm guessing the guy's Asian. Come on. Oh, goodbye. Goodbye. Yeah, apparently. Oh what a dick. God, you piece of <laughs> That's all, folks. Anyway, uh... You have responsibility, right? You're in a car, right? Right? Yeah. If I punch you in your face, how would that feel? Not good. So why the fuck would you do that to other hey, people's property? I'm sorry. Listen, listen, Respect calm down, calm down. people's f***ing property. You're right, I'm sorry. You understand? Yes. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yo. What? Listen. Yo, what? You, I'm recording, man. I don't give a f no, no. I don't give a f You think it's okay to do that? Well, do you think it's okay to do this? Yeah, it is okay. Girls like this? The world should see what the f you're doing. What did we do wrong? I don't even get it. I gotta explain what the f you did wrong just now. Dude, we saw a water. Sounds like Joe Pesci. You're ordering me out? You better get your own fucking army, pal. I you don't do that to other people's fucking property. It, it literally does nothing to you, bro. So why do it? I'm guessing they shot his car with a water gun. Yeah, great example. Yeah, what and he's pissed off and breaks their gun for shooting it with the water gun. That's uh Wow. Customer at City Star Pizza claims the wings were undercooked, but eats the whole order. <laughs> okay. You can make them feel me all you want. I didn't cook your food. Can you feel me all you want? I know I can. It's okay, hold on. It's freedom. Have cameras. Cameras everywhere. You got cameras at people. All right, Devin, you didn't got a rest. You don't have to get smart. What's up, Rob? No good. Made me sick. What happened? No good. Made me sick. Bloody meat. Bloody meat. No good. Where are you going to sit? 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 
Okay. I want to see that. There's no app on it. You don't have to do that. Listen, listen, let's try to pick up the door. There's no back. Let's go to the hospital. That's what I'm saying. My sister is here. That means it's going to sit up. This is fake. This has got to be fake. Oh, shit. It's thrown up. Why is he talking like that? What's that? It's 20 wings. What is that? What is that? 20 nasty broad wings, sir. How come, bro? You eat all the water. <laughs> what are you doing? On the beach. Listen, don't touch my feet. Man, what are you doing? Okay. <laughs> If they were raw, then I don't think I'd been eating them. Yeah. What is that? Nasty. They make another one. Come on, man. Owner of Ginsy Boba. I don't even know how to pronounce it. Owner of this place apparently wouldn't let the customer sit and relax before she ordered. Okay. Sis, that's what you are. No, I have the right to. And I have the right to sit down before I order something. No. The right. You attacked me. You attacked me with your mouth, and you told me go here. I was about to. I love Bobo drinks, but you don't give me a chance to relax for five minutes. No, I'm asking you to. Okay. It's okay, but don't rush people. You keep rushing people. You're not gonna have no business. I can relax. Hurry up and buy. Hurry up and buy. I can't do that. Come on, seriously. <laughs> You're not being reasonable, man. Hurry up and buy. I understand that. Don't bother to me. Well, because I'm relaxing. I can't relax. I don't know you. You're relaxing. You're crazy. You're crazy. No, you are. You will never. You're not going to get any customers. You're not going to have a successful business when you keep treating people like that. You have that patience when you run and operate a business. She didn't have no money. You don't have patience, lady. You're crazy. You're racist or you're crazy. She just came in to you're sit down. Crazy. Use the Wi Fi. <laughs> Video cuts off here in a second because because she left the Wi Fi area. <laughs> she didn't have any money. She just wanted to make a big deal about it. She just wanted to make a big deal about it. That's all there is to But I'm going to stand here and make a scene. Yes, I am. Because I'm entitled. I'm Karen. <laughs> Customer at Louisiana Fried Chicken gets loud with employee over wanting her food wrapped in extra foil. Oh my God! Say whatever you want to say, but I'm gonna stand my ground. I'm not scared of you. I ain't scared of you at all, and I don't need a man. So keep playing. You can see me outside. I'm not playing with you. I said I'm not playing with you. Good, because you best not be never. Oh my God, lady! You heard what I said. <clears throat> I'm somebody, mama. I don't play. So when I ask you, when I ask you, was not rude or disrespectful. Yeah, that's not I asked you, can you wrap it up with some oil? She said, I am somebody's mama. <laughs> What I said, I said about oil. I said you have some oil. No, I said you wrapped it up for me. I don't know what you're saying. I said it. When I said it, I said it. Yeah, I did. I said I'm going across here. Ask me slowly. Slowly. Talk slowly. I didn't get loud until just now. I know me. You think so? You understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? Nobody understand words that are coming out of your mouth. Be about me. <laughs> yeah, she is kind of fast talking him, and if uh, English isn't his first language, I've talked about this before. If English is not your first language, don't post in English. Don't. <laughs> That's not to do with this thing. But <laughs> if she's fast talking him, she's got to kind of slow down a little bit, you know, give him a break. If he's not fluent in English, he can. Or maybe he is fluent in English, but maybe he can't quite understand it if you're talking 100 miles an hour. That's just the way it is. <laughs> Slow down. Enunciate. <laughs> and it might get a whole lot better as far as communications go. Just saying. This guy is calling the cops on me because I'm sitting in front of his house. 
on a public street. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love that. Hi. I don't know who you are. You're sitting in front of my house. Oh yeah. So um, what? Turns out I'm allowed to do that. <laughs> What a creep, bro. Gotta love it. <clears throat> yeah, I get the cops over here. Are they gonna get the cops there? I mean. Hill. Good job, Ken. Bro, this white dude's calling the cops on me because uh, apparently I am doing drugs in my car. Okay, so they're Kens now. Which is it, and man? And I'm belligerent because I told him it was a free country and uh, I can sit in my car if I want to. <laughs> Mr. Ken over here, he doesn't like people in front of his house. Please hold. <laughs> Your call is important to us. If you don't drive us. a Tesla, he's going to call the cops on you. Please continue to hold. <laughs> really? Yeah. Uh-huh. They're really going to send someone out. Wow, Ooh. she just answered me. <laughs> My God. <laughs> it's like I was just having a conversation with her. What the... Jack in the Box employee refused to help a man at the drive-thru who was hungry and didn't have a car. Oh my god, I've been through this. I have not had a car, but I wanted to get the drive through because the lobby was closed. Oh, but hell no. They won't, you know, if you ain't got a car, you can't come to that drive through Why can't it be a walkthrough? You know? Damn. If your lobby's going to be closed, then what the hell? Strange shit. Anyway, I haven't seen this yet, but we're going to... No, no sauce. Looks like he's in a vehicle to me. What the hell? Oh, there he is. There he is. Hold on. Wait. I, no. Where's the? Uh, I need to pay for the fries and stuff. Hey, didn't what? you just give me a? Yeah, I don't take your order. I'm sorry. Oh, so you're not taking my order now? No. How come? Hey, bro. Here, have my curly fries. They gave, they gave me my order wrong. This okay. straight. Yeah. So they already. Oh, here you go, bro. So you guys already messed up my order. What's your name? I'm confused. What is your name? <clears throat> okay. I'm only recording because of the absolute joke that this service is. It's ridiculous. The fact that I've paid, I've paid for my food, and you're not even offering me a refund. You're not even offering me actual food that I've, I've not I received can't yet. Offer you anything without you receiving. If you go through and check your system, my you really order's on there. Gonna go inside there look at C that is literally your job. There. That is literally your job. I have paid for a service that I haven't received. Stop recording. That is Stop literally recording. daylight robbery. Stop 50. 50 minutes. I don't think you've been waiting here for 50 minutes. I have been waiting here for 50 minutes. You're calling me a liar? No, no, I'm not calling you a liar. <laughs> what did you order? I ordered a Big Mac. <laughs> Just a Big Mac. Meal. Large. And you didn't go inside? I ordered what did you the drive through and they told me to wait. No, but did you not go inside the store to see where your order was? I've been inside. And they said to wait out They here. said to wait in the bay. To wait in the bay. And I've been sat here for ages. Well, have you got your receipt to show me? No, because I ordered through the drive through and they didn't give me a receipt. Well, I don't know what you expect me to do then. I expect you to get my order. I've been sat here for 50 minutes. It's an actual joke. Well, I don't have any sort of confirmation as to what well, <laughs> So how in the hell does this work? I guess you don't get a receipt either until you get your food. That's a fact. So this could go both ways. If she'd been sitting there waiting, somebody didn't take the order, somebody didn't care about the order or something, or she's just trying to get some free food. <laughs> either way, they need to update their system. Maybe give you the receipt when you pay at the window before you get your food. Yeah, you'd think, but oh well. <laughs> Who knows? I'm going to display it to you. Anything okay. else you need? Do you have insurance? Yes, I do. Uh, get your insurance card and your registration. Please. Which one's the Karen? Write the ticket. Go ahead. I ain't giving you shit. I can display it to you. If you got a problem with it, let Hopefully me know. it's not the cop because it's going to be a bad day if the cops the case. Now do your job. 
It's the cop. Yep. She's the Karen. Don't scare me like that. You just fucking scared me. So scared. This could be ball bad for you, dude. Yeah, you might win it in court. Stop, man. Karen's gonna arrest your ass before she gets, just, you know, fired. I'm trying to get you that motherfucker. <laughs> she got her hand on her gun. Tracy. Stop reaching. Yep. Karens are everywhere. Unfortunately, the police department as well. Yeah. Well, even black people, I've never seen a beggar or anybody begging asking people to put it on their car. I'm not big. I'm not begging. What are you doing here? Playing music. Yeah, but I asked you to. Oh. Do you get permission from who? <clears throat> permission from who? Yes. begging you play music for free i am playing it for free technically why are you getting no money then because people want to get them. no you don't ask for that you don't put that label i'm not there. asking for it wow have to get this shit for two pounds that is begging uh, don't you know the difference i'll ask her account if you've got permission <laughs> Begging? Yeah. You got that money coming everywhere. You got that money coming everywhere. That's what I make enough. That's you make you up here every day. Begging? <laughs> yeah. No, I'm not a beggar. You are? No, I'm a performer. You're still on the still train? Yeah. No, Still I don't think it is, but it is. <laughs> definitely isn't. That's a rude woman. <laughs> Anyways. All right, then. Busking, I do believe, is what it's called. Busking, whenever you play music in public and uh, maybe have a hat or a tip jar sitting out. And uh, all the greats have done it. All the greats have done it. B.B. King did it. Come on, you know, um, <laughs> it's not begging, it's uh, donations are welcome. Sorry, Karen. That's you know who lives here? You. Yeah. you know who lives here? Yeah, I do. How do you know that I don't live Let here? Let me tell you how. Because I was here when this neighborhood was built, and I knew every single person who bought in here. Are I've you? I've been here since 2010. Are you serious right now? I'm so serious. So you know everybody that You know everyone that lives in my neighborhood. You live here? You do live yes. here. Yes. That's great if you live here. Do you live here? Yes. Oh. Okay. Wow, man. Karen Patrol. And you have your phone. Yeah. You're a coward. Oh, well, yeah? What the hell? And you have your phone. Yeah. You're a coward. Oh, well, yeah? Yes. Oh, well, yeah? You and what are you? you? What are you? Oh no, I don't. Can you please teach me? <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah. Next time, if you, if that happens with your dog to my kid, I'm oh, calling the cop on you. He was he was running. He wasn't chasing your dog. Your dog went chasing behind him. I have you on video, okay? <laughs> are you are you psycho or something? Are you sick or something? <laughs> Let's go. I think so. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, you're hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Keep going. Oh my god, you are so funny. What a bitch. There's a name for people like this. It's called K A R E N, the spelling. Yeah. Karen. Yeah. Oh my god, you're so funny. Please keep going. I want to see how how long can you go on. Are you done? <laughs> nope. Apparently wow. Not. Can I get your name on the video, please? Oh if God. you're not afraid, right? Oh my God. I just know uh, you are. Can you tell me your name? If you're so bored. I cannot tell you my name. I cannot tell it to you. I cannot tell you my name. Okay. I cannot All right, tell then. it to you, man. Hey, man. Uh, I, I cannot tell wow. you my name. Wow. You, you, you're, you're, you're a good racist yeah, acting. I'm not a racist. No. <laughs> no? You're about as welcome as a Karen at a no-return policy store. You've got more complaints than a Karen at a customer service desk. 
You're as pleasant as a Karen in a slow drive through line. You're the human equivalent of a let me speak to the manager haircut. And that's all we got. Hey, please like and